Sir William Smith, the 20th of May 1813 to the 7th of October 1893, was an English lexicographer. He also made advances in the teaching of Greek and Latin in schools. Topic: Early life. Smith was born in Enfield in 1813 of nonconformist parents. He attended the Madras House School of John Allen in Hackney. Originally destined for a theological career, he instead was articled to a solicitor. In his spare time he taught himself classics, and when he entered University College London he carried off both the Greek and Latin prizes. He was entered at Gray's Inn in 1830, but gave up his legal studies for a post at University College School and began to write on classical subjects. Topic. Career Smith next turned his attention to lexicography. His first attempt was a dictionary of Greek and Roman antiquities, which appeared in 1842, the greater part being written by him. Then followed the dictionary of Greek and Roman biography and mythology in 1849. A parallel dictionary of Greek and Roman geography appeared in 1857, with some leading scholars of the day associated with the task. In 1867, he became editor of the Quarterly Review, a post he held until his death. Topic. Publications Meanwhile, he published the first of several school dictionaries in 1850, and in 1853 he began the Principia series, which marked an advance in the school teaching of Greek and Latin. Then came the students' manuals of history and literature, of which the English literature volume went into 13 editions. He himself wrote the Greek history volume. He was joined in the venture by the publisher John Murray when the original publishing partner met difficulties. Murray was the publisher of the 1214-page Latin English dictionary based upon the works of Forcellini and Freund that Smith completed in 1855. This was periodically reissued over the next 35 years. It goes beyond classical 100 BC AD 100 Latin to include many entries not found in other dictionaries of the period including Lewis and Short perhaps the most important of the books Smith edited were those that dealt with ecclesiastical subjects these were the dictionary of the bible 1860 to 1865 the dictionary of christian antiquities 1875 to 1880 undertaken in collaboration with archdeacon samuel cheatham and the dictionary of christian biography 1877 to 1887 jointly with henry wace the atlas on which sir george grove collaborated appeared in 1875 from 1853 to 1869 Smith was classical examiner to the University of London, and on his retirement he became a member of the Senate. He sat on the committee to inquire into questions of copyright, and was for several years registrar of the Royal Literary Fund. He edited Gibbon, with Guizot's and Milman's notes, in 1854 to 1855. Dictionary of Greek and Roman Biography and Mythology 1870. Topic. Honors and death Smith was created a DCL by Oxford and Dublin, and the honor of a knighthood was conferred on him in 1892. He died on 7 October 1893 in London. Topic. Notes Topic. References This article incorporates text from a publication now in the public domain, Chisholm, Hugh, ed., 1911. Smith, Sir William. Encyclopædia Britannica. 25 11th ed. Cambridge University Press. pp. 270-271. External links Works by William Smith at Project Gutenberg Works by or about William Smith at Internet Archive. Smith, Sir William. A short biographical dictionary of English literature. Wikisource. 1910. A short history of ancient Greece with notes, study links and illustration by Elpenor. Online facsimile version of Dictionary of Greek and Roman Biography and Mythology 1870 edition. Online facsimile version of Dictionary of Greek and Roman Antiquities 1870 edition. 
Dictionary of Greek and Roman Antiquities 1875 edition.